you'll be using the Slice Virtual Slide Viewer in some of your classes. Virtual slides allow you to view features of microscopic specimens at high power on your computer. To navigate images, pan across the slide by clicking and dragging the image or use the swipe motion on a tablet device. Log in using your institution single sign-on option or using your email address and Slice password. When viewing images, zoom in and out using your mouse wheel, the plus and minus buttons or the pinch motions on a tablet. Your teacher may walk you through the features of importance using the full screen mode. While they do this, you can make notes directly on the images for study purposes. Turn off full screen mode. To start, click add layer. This will create your own personal layer to make notes on. Give it a title, for example, the tissue type you are studying. Add an optional description and the settings are preset for you for this type of activity. Click done. Start annotating by clicking annotate. Add a title to record which features you are marking out. In this example, I'll annotate mucus glands. Each feature you wish to mark out needs to be a separate annotation. Add a description, perhaps related to function and histological appearance. There are four shape types that you can use to mark out the features location on the slide. A pin, rectangle, circle or polygon. Add a pin by clicking once to collect a pin and move to the location on the image. Click again to place the pin. Pins can be moved by dragging it to a new location. Pins are perfect for small features, particularly those that are hard to see at low magnification, as they will resize to be visible at all magnifications. The rectangle and circle tools work in the same way. Make your selection and the cursor will change to crosshairs. Click and hold to drag out the shape to mark your feature. Release the cursor to finish. Edit the shape by clicking it and dragging in the corners or edges. The draw tool allows for the creation of polygons and is perfect for more complex features. Click draw and click once at the edge of the shape you'd like to start marking out. Continue clicking around the feature. Double click to finish. Each annotation can have multiple shapes that mark out many examples. Colours are randomly generated, so depending on the stains used in your slide or other annotations you've already made, you may like to change the colour by clicking the paint tin tool and choosing another colour. Click done. To mark another feature, click annotate again. Your layer is private until you choose to share it by copying the URL to the layer. Each image has a set of met descriptive metadata that may include body structures, disorders and stains. Find this by clicking the eye icon. Slice also allows you to work in groups to mark out features. Each layer has an invite button that generates a unique link that can be shared via email or your learning management system. This will allow others to see any annotations you've made and also add their own by clicking annotate and marking out features with you. At the end of each group session, we recommend duplicating the layer into your own account so you have your own record of the class activity. Note taking is an important part of learning and annotating images using pins and shapes during class activities or for private and group study can help with your study of histology and histopathology. All of your annotation layers will be saved and can be found in the collection space accessible from the navigation bar. This area organises any images or collections you have marked as a favourite and any images that you've annotated on so you can quickly revisit your previous work, perfect for exam revision. Your teacher may share collections with you that provide a list of all the images you used in class. To make it easier to find these for a revision, you can set the collection as a favourite and it will appear in your favourites folder along with any other images you've starred. You may also be given questions that test your feature identification knowledge. Review the question on the left, navigate the image by zooming and panning across and collect a pin from the top left hand corner to indicate where you believe the feature is located. 
Click the blue check your responses button and immediate feedback is given. Try again, collect another pin and review any feedback provided for the question. Questions you have answered can also be revisited in the collection space. You can return to Slice at any time and find all of your resources here.